Good morning, this is Frank Taylor with the Google Earth blog and I'm going to show you the exciting new collection of 3D buildings for Berlin. That's right, the city of Berlin just yesterday released over 44,000 models of 3D buildings for their city. Almost 10% of their city has been released so far. And uh, right off here you can see the famous TV Tower of Berlin, a very famous landmark and we're flying over. You're only seeing a very small part. Um, here is the St. Mary's Church in the background. And just to show you the kinds of details, here is a statue of Neptune just in the park. Uh, there's a town hall. I've never been to the city of Berlin myself, but now thanks to Google Earth and this collection of 3D models, I've actually learned a little bit about the city. Right here is the Berlin Cathedral, and the detail here is just amazing. Uh, look at all of the ornamentation on the tops of the uh, towers here, and the statues in the front of the building, and all four sides have been modeled in detail with textures. We're going to fly over here to a, a famous square, and as you go over, you'll notice that the buildings are being brought in in the background. As you get closer, the buildings come in. As you move away, they disappear, so you're only looking at a subset, and the textures load up after the, the models load up. And here is, uh, there's two churches in this square. This one is the German Cathedral, and we'll move around, and you can see some of the detail here. And uh, next is a, uh, this is the concert hall where, where the uh, Berlin Orchestra plays. And just look at the detail, there are, even this little lamp is model, there are statues in front, the columns in the building, the facade, and even the statues on the top. And over here is the French Cathedral. And again, look at all the detail, the columns around the sides and the windows and the um, tops of the roof. And now we're going to fly over a bunch of the buildings and uh, let's try going down one of the streets like we're a car driving down the street. And by the way, if you're wondering how I'm moving around, I'm using the 3D Connection Space Navigator, which is just a fantastic, it's like a 3D mouse that lets you easily move around and and uh, fly around 3D objects and and see things in Google Earth. And I'm looking for a building, um, I don't see it here, so uh, let's see, let's look up above, and, uh, oh, there it is. What we're looking at now is the seat of power of Germany. This is the parliament building, and uh, the city of Berlin says they had modeled this and several other buildings in great detail, and, and in fact, yes, you can see all the windows and uh, details, ornamentation, the facade in the front columns all modeled in, de in detail and uh, but more interesting let's go in through the front door and yes you guessed it the interior is also modeled so here you can actually see the seats where the ministers conduct the business of the government and this is all being done underneath this uh, famous dome that was actually destroyed during World War II and we can look up here and see it very interesting. Uh, unfortunately, Google Earth doesn't handle looking up very well, but uh, with the 3D Space Navigator, you can actually uh, do that. Now we're going to fly over here to one of the train stations, a uh, very modern train station, and uh, you'll be amazed here. Look, look what they have implemented inside here. They actually have people in there and also the trains and the billboards and even the signs showing the destinations and you can see through the windows of the structure here at the other buildings outside and of course we can fly right through the windows now we're flying over one of the parks and we're looking at another very interesting building here very interesting architecture this is the Sony Center which you can see the sign here on the top and uh, since Sony's big into movies, they have an IMAX theater here on the inside. This huge atrium on the interior with elevators and everything. And now we can fly back outside. And we're almost done here. Uh, let's see, the last thing we're going to look at is the Holocaust Memorial, where all these uh, signs of showing the names of those who were killed during the Holocaust. 
Well, thank you very much uh, to the City of Berlin for releasing this exciting collection of 3D buildings. Uh, you can explore it for hours. Hopefully it will get into the Google Earth layer soon.